Is that like that? Thank you. Love it. This is a good sign. <laughs> Another Gernard! Oh, flathead! Oh, it's a nice looking flathead. Okay, beautiful flathead. Good size That's and a, a nice keeper. Size. Seagull on steroids. Oh. Albatross, go away. Shoo. Shoo. No. Bad bird. Bad bird. Bad oh, bird. Oh, bad oh, bird. Oh. Bird. Die. Oh, okay, bird. Now get out of that. Get out of here. All right, it's getting closer. Can't see any colour. Oh, no, there we are. We Gurnard. So apparently Gurnards are a nice tasting fish. I've never tasted one before. I wouldn't even know where to start to fill it at, so we might need to do some Googling. Oh, it's flat. Yay! Yay, 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 yay. Beautiful size flathead. Look at him. We are six nautical miles and just east of the mouth of the Tamar River. That is a beautiful flathead. That's got to be at least 40 centimetres. I am one happy fish, fisher lady. <laughs> I don't know what you're catching. <laughs> <laughs> Sam's definitely on. I just feel like I'm pulling up a heavy weight. I think I've got a flathead. I feel this is more of a fighter than the Gernard have been. I'm hoping for another 40 centimetre flathead. We just moved probably a kilometre further east. Didn't have any bites for a while. I haven't been down for long and straight on. Brilliant. Oh, what have I got? No complaints because this is the first time we've decided to keep Bernard before. Um, we're going to try to fillet these and cook them up and see what they taste like. We've been told they're actually a really tasty fish. And if they are, well, we're going to be on some winners because there's plentiful of Gernard out here. That's a beautiful flathead, it's Bethany. It's beautiful. I thought it was heavy too. Yeah. Well, my wrist and my arm was killing me, but it wasn't giving any fight. It was just a very heavy weight. So that was very exciting to pull yeah. it up and to see I what I've caught. That's beautiful flathead. That is a second for at least 40 centimeter yeah. flathead we've caught in the space of 20 minutes. So we're going to get these fish off and get these yep. lines straight back in. Definitely. Yeah. yeah. Let's do this. Not giving much of a fight. The anticipation of what you're gonna get. Oh, I can see something down there. But I reckon that might be a double header. Yeah, we got two gurnards. <laughs> there we have it, double headers. Oh, I've got a flathead. It's a fatty, isn't it? It's a big one. I think that is by far <laughs> the biggest flathead I've probably seen. Now, I thought my 40 centimetre one was big. That's looking a little bit small now. Wow, I'm putting him down because I'm going to get back out there. It's thirsty work, Sam. Mm -hmm. That sun is hot. It's warm. It's hot. Oh, that was sight getting and weight getting those two up. We've got a tiger flathead and a gurnard, and they're both good sizes. 
with a double header. Is it? We will turn them to the water. Mum's got a double header over Mom's here. Mum's got an Irish. Oh, on there. I better leave it alone. <laughs> oh, what happened? What did he go for it? What is it? Oh, you bird. Oh, okay, hold it. Someone's going to get in there. Didn't want to lose that oh one. Oh my goodness. That is, is huge. huge. He's a biggie. And it was fun bringing him up. When I saw him coming up, I thought, okay, this is the biggest flathead I've ever caught. It doesn't feel like Nana's 50 centimetre flathead, but. What does it feel like? It feels like a Gernard. <laughs> I like what you said before. What did I call it before? Gurney? You said it felt Gernardy. It felt Gernardy, yeah. <laughs> but Nana just caught an absolute whopper. I was right. Oh no! I was wrong. Oh, you got a flathead there, Jane. I was really wrong. Well, I said it felt Gernardy. I was completely wrong. It felt flatheady. <laughs> We've had a brilliant afternoon fishing on RC Jacks and we've been catching gurnards and none of us have actually eaten or cooked them before. We've got a barbecue up on the top deck, so we've come up, we've got it started and we're going to try some. And I'll serve it up to the girls and we'll see what we think. I'm hoping we get some sizzle. Oh, beautiful. So we're just going to cook with a bit of salt, a bit of oil and just a tad of lemon juice. We're in 40 metres of water and we don't have a sea anchor. So we are rolling and we're sort of drifting on the side. Hence that gentle roll. I reckon this fish is ready to flip. So I'm gonna cook two of these fillets till they're quite dry. And the other two I'm gonna leave them so there's still plenty of moisture in them. And I'm just gonna squeeze a bit of lemon juice on these. I still wanna get the flavour from the flip fish. I only want to squeeze a little bit of lemon on there. I'll tell you what, it's smelling good. <laughs> There's that roll I'm <laughs> telling you about. And you would never guess it if you oh, were here. Oh, lemon! Okay, there, was... <laughs> there goes the lemon. Casualty overboard. <laughs> but you'd never guess from looking out here, the roll we're experiencing, it's quite strange. Because it looks so calm and beautiful. And it is beautiful out here, but there really is a <laughs> decent roll. As you can see, lemon has been rescued. Sam's catch of the day for the chef. Sam's catch of the day. <laughs> she cooks also the lemons. <laughs> I'm going to take these two fillets off the tribe. They're only just cooked through, which is generally how they say you should cook your fish. But our family like our fish cooked well. Nice, crispy, crunchy around the edges. So I'm going to make sure these are done well. Fish is ready, guys. Three or four. Please. Got one. I can't wait. I've been smelling it down there while I've been fishing. This one here yes. is only just cooked through. This one here is cooked how you like it. That, you know, yeah. Well yeah. done. Crispy on yeah. the edges. Yeah. Okay. We'll try this one here first. Yeah, this one first. So this is just cooked through. Okay, this is really good though. That one there. That one. Oh, that's really lovely. Mm. I think that's very nice. That's beautiful. That's really nice. Mm. Really nice. It's not fishy. It doesn't have no. that really strong fishy flavour. The flavor. lemon is really nice. It's a firm flesh. Mm. Mm. Yeah, that's oh, nice. I agree, it's, it's not, not fishy. It's not tough no. though. No, no. That's a nice juicy piece of meat. And tender, it's beautiful. Yeah. Can I have a try of the cook? Which one here is um, quite well done? Oh. That's my favourite. Yeah, that's my, that, I prefer that. Is it dried out beautiful. or? Oh, oh yeah. Not, not really. Wow. No. no, that's good. It's, there's such a meaty fish it's without having the a, fishy flavour. Yeah. And the brown on it has given it a yeah. beautiful mm. texture and flavour. No, that was beautiful. Really nice. I, yeah. We've caught these for many years and thrown them back, haven't realised how delicious they are. I think we've always been put off from keeping them because they've always looked awkward with all the old spikes and they've never looked only that big like there'd be much flesh on it. But um, I was surprised with just how much flesh, mm. um, or the fi sorry, the fillet came from that fish. Yeah. Mm. So definitely worth keeping. But the cameraman like a ton. Yeah. Oh, Nana's on. Let's hope it's another gurnard.
I was just upstairs giving Becky a hand, then I'm on. It's another gurnet, which we're happy about because we just had that earlier and it was absolutely delicious. Close to my legs, I don't want to get stuck. It's a nice size. That'll be interesting. It might be a salmon or a mullet. Oh, look, something else is oh, down there. Oh. Oh, whoa, whoa. What was that? Hey. There was something. Oh, Bring it in. Hey. We cooked up the gurnard earlier and everyone loved it. It was a new experience for us. The flathead, not quite so new experience. We've been lovers and eaters of flathead for many years. But I don't know whether we've actually caught flathead and had it on the barbecue ready to eat within about 10, 15 minutes of um, catching the fish. So this is fresh fish. A little bit of oil, a little bit of salt, a little bit of lemon juice, and that is it. Other than a knob of butter, which I found on the boat, which I was thrilled at. Everything tastes better with a little bit of butter. All right, let's flip them. Lovely, you can see it's just starting to flake away. This is just falling apart now. So that is going to be yummy. Alright, dig in. This is flathead. Flathead, freshly caught. It's just pulling apart. Absolutely yeah. delicious. Look at that. Well, oh, you did catch it. That is beautiful. Mm. Ha <laughs> ha